welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. Today is a review on this product that I purchased myself on Amazon. This is the, and don't quote me on how to say this, Seg Mini Smart, right, that's what it says. Yeah, so Seg, Seg Mini Smart V-Line Mask. If this is the kind of video that you're into, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that bell button. Let's get into the video. So basically, as you've probably heard before, I uh, I hate my double chin. Yeah, I put a bit of weight on. That doesn't help the fact that um, I'm getting loose skin here because of my age. Do I mention my age every time I do a video? I think I do, don't I? I think I've seriously got hung up. But anyway, yeah, um, I hate my double chin. Um, I've had one session just before lockdown of the strawberry laser and I could see results straight away. But obviously I, I was due to go for another three sessions, but obviously lockdown happened. Um, it was something that I was going to do a video on because I want to obviously tell you everything that I do. Um, but um, I've not been able to go. So they've been rescheduled now for, I think, June time. So hopefully I can go at that point. Um, so yeah, um, I might even be getting some filler in my jaw as well. So disclaimer out there, people, I think injectables are sort of no, no, you know, don't judge me. It's just, I'm trying to slow down my aging process. So yeah, so don't judge me people but um yeah I have a bit of a hang up now I don't have a hang up about anything else okay so it is just my chin I'm getting jowls here um which I, I hate to be honest and it kind of sort of knocks your confidence a little bit um I hate my side profile um so obviously which is why I got the uh, electronic sort of device that I mentioned in my Amazon thing and my Amazon buys I'll leave a link here but I did it to try and tighten up my skin so one of my problem areas is obviously my lids which I hate as well but you can hide that with lashes um again I was going to go and have surgery on that but I'm not at the moment. So if I was going to have anything done, it would be my eyelids and something done to my chin. So that is it. I'm not, you know, I'm not worried about anything else. But going back to my chin, because I'm going off topic, is the fact that I hate the fact that um, when I look down like this, and sometimes I've done videos and think, maybe I should have retook them. But um, if I've been looking down or whatever, so I try and angle my camera slightly up now, uh, it kind of emphasizes this bit of skin here. So I'm just gonna do a, um, a side profile so that you can see the before. So this is me uh, as it is. Um, again, I've not had the strawberry laser now. It's been at least five weeks, I think. Um, so again, you're meant to have them once every three weeks for four sessions and I've only had one and um, so it's only made a tiny bit of difference but I hate this sort of skin here and obviously I could probably have a little bit of lipo on it or something but obviously I'm trying to do stuff at home as well so I did purchase going back to what I purchased is this bean line mask now you get five in here I think it was 20 pound I'll leave it below because I can't remember um it's a double chin reducer it's one of those that go up double so I'm just introducing it at the minute and we're going to try it later because this says to wear it for eight hours now I've seen some on YouTube where you just wear them for an hour I can't see that happening to be honest it's not going to do it in an hour is it so I think I need to wear all five but um I'm going to wear the first one give you the results but I'm going to wear it overnight so repair time it's up to what is up to eight hours so uh, basically it says this ma mask works while you sleep so I'm going to sleep in mine um yeah and that's basically it really so yeah you've got um five in the box so this is the packaging that it looks like and then inside they come like totally unmarked so it could literally be anything and they're in there so I'm going to give these a go tonight so for you it'll be like one second uh, and I'm going to film that a little bit later but um yeah so um we'll get around to fitting this and um, obviously later on tonight and then we can have a look uh, at the results in the morning so I'll see you shortly. Hi guys so I've just cleansed my face um and I'm ready for my mask so I'm going to get one out kind of comes on like a plastic sort of material right now let's not get this wrong <laughs> uh, because um i think that bit is for the mouth oh my god so this looks like that bit first let's get my hair out of there 
kind of like a handball lecture right now and that's better and then this bit goes underneath so it's quite cooling so it's not too tight actually I saw some reviews where it was quite tight on the ears but mm, I find it quite comfortable unless I've got a small head I don't know so let's make sure that's doing the best it can underneath the chin so it is kind of pulling my ears a little bit what a look eh <laughs> so right so I'm gonna obviously uh, get in bed it is now um, quarter to twelve so it's quite late um, and I'll catch you guys in the morning I hope I can manage the whole evening with this on I should have said it all night um, looks like I feel like I've got a white beard so yeah let's see what this does um, overnight and I'll catch you all in the morning so good morning guys it is now just gone eight so I've had this on for eight hours um, the only thing I can say is it really hurts your ears um, so as for the results let's get this off and let's just see um just the first thing before i take it off the first thing that i noticed when i put it on it was itchy and it was cold for quite a long time i think it's because it was cold that it made it itchy it's kind of warmed up a little bit now it's not like that ice cold it was just like ice cold for ages it was kind of uncomfortable but not unbearable but just a little bit just not you're just not used to it basically so let's take this off and let's see Ugh. so glad to get that off now from looking forward what i'll try and do is i'll try and move to the side I'll try and put a comparison picture on this side uh, so that we can see the difference because it's difficult sometimes when you look in without the old photo sometimes you know better when you're comparing so here's the view from the front and then i'm going to turn to the side does it look any more defined i think i feel like the jowls at the front don't seem to be like protruding as much they kind of sort of like look like little pockets there but to me they look a little bit smoother um, i'd have to see the footage just to see um what i thought so i'm gonna edit that together have a look at the before and after and give you my final review so i'll catch you in a second hi guys i've just been editing this beeline mask now um, i'm up to the bit where i'm comparing pictures um, as you can see here, I've just laid them side by side. Now, for me, let me just put cut in a bit closer. I do feel like this is a little bit less. You'll see when you see the clip yourself. I do feel like it's slightly a little bit less sort of protruding than it was before. I am talking sort of minuscule. Um, again, I have only worn one and there are five in the box. So maybe if I did all five, maybe I'd see a better result. So um, whether it's worth it or not, I don't know. It's worth giving it a go, but I couldn't tell you whether it was value for money or whether it completely worked. I only saw a little bit of a change. Um, it just felt a little bit less puffy. And I don't know whether it's because it's using kind of like compression to sort of get rid of that um but um yeah so i mean what i'll have to do is i'm gonna have to wear all five i might come back and do another review on it if you're interested leave me a comment below if that's something that you are interested in i'm certainly looking at ways to um getting rid of my double chin which i completely hate but um yeah hopefully um if i wear the rest of the masks hopefully i'll get a better result so anyway i'm gonna leave the video here i hope you enjoyed it if you're gonna give me a big thumbs up that'd be brilliant if you want to subscribe you can do it in the link below don't forget to follow me on instagram and i'll leave it on the screen and i'll see you all in the next video bye